So we're out actually in the forest itself. Is this, would this be called the forest? Absolutely. Okay, so, and we were walking along and we're actually talking about the environment because, I mean, this park, it's, it's our investment. As, That's right. As it's our resource and it's our responsibility to take care of it. And so Matt was telling me about some things that are happening with the trees and the reason why there's an orange dot there. So you tell them what it is and, and what you're trying to do to uh, stop the invasive species that's coming in. Sure. This is a this is a hemlock tree behind us here. This is a uh -huh. hemlock forest, mixed hemlock forest, and it creates this really nice kind of, for this part of the world, open forest type that's more fun to walk through as a ranger or a visitor. Uh -huh. But unfortunately, we have a, a, a pest, a bug, from, um, from overseas that's here killing these trees. It's called the hemlock woolly adelgid. And it's in the aphid family, and it will kill um, wow. every every hemlock tree around here, um, except that. And you can imagine what that would be like if all these hemlock trees were on the ground. Right. It totally changes the environment. A lot of creatures that depend, particularly in streams, stream uh, the hemlocks really like the cool environment around streams and stuff. So, right. so it opens all that up and just totally changes the ecosystem, makes it a lot less beautiful and a lot less of a pleasant experience for. Uh, for the visitor, but um, thankfully, and so you're you're treating it exactly. Right. Thankfully, there's something uh -huh. we can do, which is what this orange dot on this tree signifies. It it lets us know that it's been treated. Um, there's a chemical that that uh, can be applied to the to the root system of the tree, uh -huh. and the tree soaks that uh, chemical up, and then the tree is protected for around five years. Right. Um, and so then, uh, so we haven't been able to treat the entire forest, but we've treated areas right around the most heavily used visitor access points and areas of special ecological significance. So so that's just one thing that these that the park rangers the the NPS, right? That's right. is doing to protect our resources. If you want to check out more about Obed, where should they go to? You can learn a lot more about us on our website. Also uh -huh. we're on social media, face follow us on Facebook or Twitter um, and uh, Good stuff, protecting the environment. It's all good for us and it's good for it's good for our forestry. That's right. Thanks, Matt. You're welcome. Yeah. Thank you.